October is Domestic Violence Awareness Month. Tonight, a Port St. Lucie woman is on a mission to bring awareness by sharing her own experience. Treasure Coast Bureau reporter Angela Rozier has her story and why a local psychologist says education can save lives. Experts say one in three women and one in four men here in the U.S. experience domestic violence. This is video of Port St. Lucie police responding to a domestic disturbance call back on September 28th. According to the CDC, domestic violence is a common problem and it affects an estimated 10 million people in the U.S. every year. We have to also remember that those statistics are, you know, likely not even accurate, right? It's probably higher because there are a lot of people that do not report it. Clinical psychologist Rachel Needle says it's important that people on both sides of the issue be educated. When you don't understand the cycle of abuse, you may say, well, I don't understand. Why did that person stay? And, you know, they could just leave. And um, a lot of times that will not only isolate and push the person that's experiencing domestic violence away, but it, that judgment feels very personal. Amanda Fialho says her six-year-old triplets were at home with her the day her husband was shot and killed by police when he threatened to set propane tanks on fire inside their Port St. Lucie home. He's never had this look he had on his face. Um, and he said, you need to be prepared to die today because I'm prepared to die today. She's now on a mission to bring awareness to the issue. I will gladly help anybody I can if they're in the situation, but I want to make sure that this never happens to another family. You know, I think it's incredibly important that people that are open and comfortable with speaking up do share their story. And if you are struggling, I encourage you to uh, reach out to a licensed mental health professional that specializes in this area so that they understand and have you know expertise in this area. And you can always call 211 for resources and referrals as well. Angela Rozier, WPBF 25 News.